So I'm making my second cup of coffee of today, which I don't know if that's a good idea or not, but I really, I really fancy a cup of coffee right now. Tomorrow is super exciting because tomorrow is day one of Inktober. I've done so much preparation, so I'm very excited to be able to release my first piece. For all of October, I'm going to try to film my process while I draw the inktober pieces my brain isn't working i also lately in a i guess an update i don't know if i've ever shown my bedroom in a studio vlog but here it is um i'm usually just like in the studio like living room desk area but um this is our bedroom it's very plain very boring and I was sitting in here yesterday trying to figure out how I can, I don't know, just how I can make it a little better. I don't want to spend a lot of money or anything, but I just, I don't know. I don't know if I should move the furniture around. If I do end up doing it, I'll definitely film it so you can see what I'm doing. I think that sitting in the house too much is the reason why I keep thinking I want to move around my furniture. I want to change things up because we spend so much time here. So that's the update. I'm so excited for Inktober tomorrow. I can't wait and I can't wait for you guys to see the pieces I'll be coming up with. I also just wanted to show you the dress I'm wearing today because this is like my favorite dress maybe, one of my favorites that I have and I really only wear it in autumn and winter just because of the colors and so I'm very happy that it's autumn now so I can wear this dress. Okay. <laughs>
Inktober has started. Um, you will have seen quite a few clips of me preparing and drawing pieces. I'm already feeling a little bit overwhelmed by Inktober, which is so silly because everyone has been saying leading up to Inktober, like, don't stress about it. It should just be for fun. Don't work yourself too hard, etc. I'm and I'm still very excited about Inktober and I'm really enjoying creating the pieces. And what I've been doing is creating the pieces ahead of time. I've been kind of cheating a little bit. Um because I just felt overwhelmed about creating the piece on the day that I would upload it, especially because I work during the day and then um a lot of people because of time zones and stuff, I wouldn't be posting it until very late and I was scared that I wouldn't have enough time to finish it and I didn't want to stress myself out about completing the piece after work. And now I feel stressed, which is very silly because I'm now five days ahead of schedule. So I've just completed Monday's um, piece. So Monday is probably when I will upload this video. And I just already feel very stressed out about it, which is stupid to be honest I shouldn't be this stressed I'm also very ahead of time so I don't know maybe this weekend I'll take a little break um, and just like edit this video relax and then maybe I won't feel so overwhelmed <laughs> from the store. I'm a little too tall for this. Hold on. So I just got home from the store and I thought I'd show you a haul. Um, a very boring adult haul. I got a lint roller. It kind of looks like a toilet brush, but it's a lint roller. I got a new sponge head, mop head, and then dish soap. Wow, so adult, so interesting. Um, really, the only thing I wanted to show you is this. <laughs> um, they had like a Halloween section at my little local like drugstore. And Boom Chicka Pop has a pumpkin spice kettle corn flavor. So I purchased it. <laughs> It smells like, oh they're all kind of good. It smells like, like an autumn candle. <laughs> it just looks like regular kettle corn, as you can see. Cheers. Oh, oh, it left sticky residue in my hands. 
it's not really pumpkin spice flavor. It's more of like a cinnamon bun flavor. They're good. They taste like little cinnamon buns. Not bad. I give it three out of five. Will I ever purchase it? I don't know. But it, it's fun to try. Yeah, I had actually already finished the end of this vlog before I went out to the store, but I was in a very grumpy mood. I went out, walked over to the store, picked up these boring things I needed to get, and I feel a little better actually. And I didn't want to end the vlog on like a sour, grumpy note, because that's no fun. Yeah, I feel much better. If you're feeling really bad, just go for a walk. You might feel a little better. But anyway, this has been the first week of Inktober. It's been stressful, it's been good. I hope if you're participating in Inktober that you're having a good time and that you're not stressed out like I've made myself stressed out. It's going to be a very chill evening. No stress for me, no sir. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope that you are having a great day and I will see you in my next one. Bye.